But we're starting tonight with breaking news on the heels of a series of stories we've been reporting. Ford Motor Company is recalling nearly 500,000 SUVs. 7 Action News investigator Bill Proctor is live at Ford headquarters in Dearborn. Bill, what's the recall involved? Well, there's no doubt there have been at least 100 complaints that were sent into the federal government, the National Transportation Safety Administration, looking closely at this at least for the last week or so. But their broader probe essentially followed a story that our sister station in Phoenix, Arizona, did because that's where the single fatality in this situation took place. Ford today issued a safety recall on 485,000 2001 to 2004 Ford Escapes and Mavericks with 3 liter V6 engines. Ford says the recall is to fix sticking gas pedals that can cause crashes. It stems from a speed control cable issue that's been at the center of our sister station's investigation. The recall comes five months after 17-year-old Sage Bloom died in Payson, Arizona. Bloom's 2002 Ford Escape accelerated out of control and crashed in January, killing the teenager. We found Ford warned its dealers about a speed control cable issue seven years ago. Since then, we looked at other crashes involving accelerating escapes and talked with advocates calling for a second recall. This is just the tip of the iceberg, you know, and, you know, thanks to the, the Bloom uh, investigation, we're going to get to the bottom of it. Apparently, uh, the number of complaints against the escapes ran to about 68 out of the 99 total, but the National Transportation Safety Administration essentially has uh, demanded and uh, will receive this recall. Uh, hundreds of thousands of vehicles still to be fixed by the Ford Motor Company, a relatively simple fix, we are told. Reporting live in Dearborn, Bill Proctor, 7 Action News.